So as it turns out, Scarlett Johansson is in fact back working with Disney and Marvel Studios, and the most recent reveal of the Thunderbolts trailer confirmed her involvement with that film. Now of course, she's not back as the Black Widow as far as we know, although that could change with the use of the multiverse, but let's talk about how she's back as a producer. Back in 2021, we found out that Scarlett Johansson, after having a very public falling out over the whole um, Black Widow streaming situation and the former CEO of Disney, Bob JPEG, that she was signed on for a first look deal, a development deal, and a overall production deal. And there's been a lot of rumors coming from various insiders such as Daniel RPK and others that she was in fact going to be lending her services to the first project she's directly attached to, which would be the upcoming, again, according to insiders, Blonde Phantom Disney Plus series. Now, as it turns out, a lot of these reports were wrong because we haven't heard any movement on the Blonde Phantom just yet, but we did find out that Scarlett Johansson is in fact a producer on the upcoming Thunderbolts. So getting the title executive producer could mean plenty of things because she is sharing this title with the likes of uh, Brian Chapek, Jason Tomaz, and Luis D'Esposito, who of course, again, has been credited for a lot of Marvel content. So realistically, what we're looking at here is, at least in my opinion, her ties to Black Widow since Yelena is going to be the new Black Widow. Just like how James Gunn is going to get credits on all future appearances of the Guardians of the Galaxy because he came up with those characters and concepts, Scarlet is tied inherently and deeply into Black Widow and working out new deals and things like that. So her being an executive producer here probably has something to do with, uh, you know, her time as Black Widow, but also maybe helping out, you know, Florence Pugh behind the scenes or something. Or maybe she was there to kind of uh, line things up because we heard that this uh, Blonde Phantom project might tie into the more, like, subdued street side of things. Let's put it that way. So maybe there's something here. Maybe they'll reveal something in this. But um, up until we get there, I guess all we know is she's a producer for right now. And uh, she's definitely back with Disney. 